All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are doing it. We are doing it. I don't watch any horror movies whatsoever, oh, but caught on camera. Let's do it, man. Dancing with the dead. Eleven years ago, Tony Nogueira recorded a short video of his son Elijah dancing to a Green Day song that was playing on their TV. He Dang. uploaded the video to his YouTube channel, and for years? years the video went mostly unnoticed. That is until Tony's footage was shared on Reddit, and hundreds of Reddit users agreed on Reddit one experts? thing: there's something truly bizarre going oh, on in this video. Oh hell no! Oh hell no, bro! The quality. On top of hey, just hey, makes hey, it hey, even hey, more creepy. Hey. I see hey, something hey. though. Oh no. Oh no. Ah! Got you right there. Sorry guys. Did you see it? Nah, I feel right like I did. Little Elijah, what looks like the dark, shadowy figure of a oh. child can be seen. Just oh. kind of standing there watching the family. Honestly, I saw this thing later, there. And Not the, child the face. disappears. Even creepier, right after the small shadowy figure is seen, a strange, unexplained childlike giggle can be heard. Dang. Eliza, go like this. Dang. Now, Yo. I reached out to Tony Noguera personally, and he says that he has no idea who or what this unexplained figure might be. But he says his house does have a very creepy history. Tony's house is yeah, inside a gated run, community run, in right Reno, now, Nevada. Dude. And the property on which the neighborhood was built used to be an old graveyard back in the 1960s. So could I don't know if I believe be it. the ghost of a child buried on the community grounds long ago? Let me know what you think down My, in the comments. He, I, I feel like it's really just haunted. some sort of illusion or something. The YouTube channel really haunted. I don't know if I believe it. I don't know. There's a hot spot for strange paranormal activity. For over two years, Lee and his family have witnessed and captured terrifying events caught on static cameras that are set up throughout their home. Now, if you're a longtime Nuke Stop 5 viewer, you've probably seen some of Lee's scary poltergeist moments in my videos. Dang. And well, dude. Things have only gotten worse. Listen, man. Late okay, I'll night, say what. Fast asleep in bed when his hallway and bedroom static cameras capture something downright chilling. Mm, I will tell you what, man. If the cats, if the animals behave differently to something that's going on, that that's when I would like. Okay, maybe there's something. Okay, like if the animals are chilling, then I would be like, nah, nothing that. Yo, I feel like something. Oh no. Oh oh. What was that? Did somebody throw like their mama upside down or something? Yeah, I, I'm kind of, I'm kind of backing out right now because I, I. Dang, dude. Yeah, he was sleeping. The room. Maybe there was like a small like earthquake or something. You never know. Like you know, it could be. Yeah, that stuff is shaking. You know, just tiny bit. That that must be the cat fur or something. He wakes up. And it stops. A shadow figure seems to slowly rise from the floor in the hallway and then inexplicably zooms upwards into the ceiling. Dang, dude. Yeah. Lee yeah. says that whatever this strange shape was, it actually knocked open the attic door. The sounds you hear in the video are the attic door being violently pushed open and then just moved around. Then later, we cut to Lee's bedroom, and now whatever is in the attic seems to be moving Lee's overhead lamp around. But so is he putting cameras inside because weirder. he has been because experiencing stuff later, like that? Lee's wife Stacy is home For and while? passed to sleep in bed when she experiences something absolutely terrifying. Oh no, oh no. Yeah, I don't wanna, I don't wanna watch these videos, bro. Like, I don't wanna watch y'all. Oh no. Ah! I sh I'm pretty sure I got somebody. This time, I'm pretty sure I got somebody. I'm pretty sure I got somebody. Maybe not you, but maybe the guy behind you. Maybe the guy behind you. I'm just gonna double check behind me. Did you see it? Oh. Now this one is a little hard to catch, but when the footage is sped up, you can clearly see another unexplained shadowy mass slowly floating towards Stacy before what if it violently it yanks her hair. Surprisingly, the seemingly painful incident didn't wake her, and Stacy says she doesn't remember any of it. 
After viewing the footage, the couple was understandably pretty freaked out. Lee Dang. says that this is the most terrifying footage that he has ever caught. But what if, what if it's like somebody with green screen clothes? Because now those are a thing, right? Like you can actually green screen yourself out. And surely in cameras, I I'm pretty certain you will still see the shadow depending on the light. Y you know what I mean, right? Like it could because be it seems that green screen is out his too. home is becoming more and more violent and aggressive. I highly recommend that you check out all of Lee's paranormal experiences over on his YouTube channel. But really it's still interesting. Haunted. It's tr it's interesting. I'm not denying that. And it might be true. I don't know. For the top five, or if you have a ghost hunting channel and you caught something great, contact me at nukestop5 at gmail.com. The thing. If you're enjoying, in the woods. smash like, hit the subscribe bell. This next mysterious video was sent to the popular Japanese YouTube channel, Fourth Wall. They explained oh, no. that there was no extra information attached to the email in which the video file was shared. They tried reaching out to the sender, but. They got no reply back. In the video, These videos a man are so appears good. to be walking through the woods, seemingly looking for someone. What happens next is absolutely horrifying. My guy, I never watch horror movies. If you got a recommendation, let me know. Because I'm kind of getting into that content too. Oh, oh dang. This gives me a little bit of oh, oh my god oh, oh yo yo I genuinely got a little a little chill chills running through my spine right now god damn bro yeah I I I, I don't want to know any recommendation <laughs> I I don't wanna these YouTube videos are enough these YouTube videos are enough. <laughs> Yo, you just run, bro. Leave. Even if it's a human trick trying to trick you, it's not a good thing, right? It's not a good thing. Yeah, um, I, I'm like, nah, I don't want to look. Oh, 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 oh! Whoa, whoa! In the distance, what appears to be a tree whoa. branch can be seen moving bizarrely on its own. And shortly after, the man spots two translucent things Aliens? walking out of the dark forest. One large figure and one small. Now, you must some be people the... in Fourth Wall's comment section suspect that the man might be looking for someone inside the infamous Aoki Gihara forest. The same forest where many Japanese men and women take their own lives. Oh, that's the but forest! That's the same one, think? I think. You can watch many more creepy where Logan videos Paul of strange, did what he did, right? over on the YouTube channel, Fourth Wall. Viewer mm. videos. Nuke's Top 5 viewer Rocky reached out to me about a video his sister took at their family home in South Florida. Rocky claims that their home might be haunted as the family has witnessed their TV turning on by itself, glasses suddenly breaking, and the voice of an older man coming from somewhere inside their house. Even stranger, Rocky claims that they have seen glimpses of strange shadow figures throughout the house. Oh, Rocky says snap. that their home is in a bit of a bad neighborhood where many horrible crimes have taken place. He says that he wonders if their home could have been the site of some tragic event that caused the haunting. One day, Rocky's sister Jay believes she saw yet another shadow figure in the bathroom of their house and begins to record with her phone. Mm, I don't know, what man. What she captures is truly bizarre. That's the thing, bro. Like, these videos are really fun to watch and they're entertaining and it kind of challenges your beliefs and your mind and whatnot. I do believe that these things exist personally, but I'm not sure about these videos per se, if that makes sense. You, you know what I mean? What am I looking at? There's like a guy with the, in the portrait. Okay, he's recording his homie, I think. He's yeah, he's having a large one. He's having a large one. Yo, that teddy bear is kind of <laughs> creeping me out, bro. Did you see it? Wait, what? As Jay is playfully switching back and forth between her phone's selfie and front camera. I did she not see that. what appears to be a very strange shadow right behind Bruh. her brother. Bruh, now, when no way. this footage, it should be noted that Rocky is holding a large cup in his right hand. Virtually eliminating the possibility that this strange shadow might be his own arm. At the speed that the shadow flies upwards, it seems very unlikely that Rocky would be throwing his beverage up like that. There's also mm. nothing behind Rocky that could explain the sudden appearance and disappearance of the shadow. There's Bro, I don't know about bear. that. So just what is this? That looks like Voldemort, my guy. Like Voldemort taking off. 
This next creepy video was something like, by a like that. Top five viewer who has a family member who works at the Huntington County Historical Museum in Indiana. The Huntington Museum is home to a collection of Indiana historical artifacts and sits right next to the Old Town Railroad track. And to me, I'm just saying, ancient historical artifacts. Yo, the color correction on these videos are just old fire, bro. Like, I love equals, it. It's, it's probably haunted. But let's take a closer look. One day when the museum is closed and empty, the security camera motion detector is triggered by something. When the staff checks the footage, they are shocked by what they find. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay, so it's basically... Whoa! 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 Damn, you gotta look at around the stairs. Hey! 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 That's a robber! That's a, that's a burglar! That's definitely a robber. A dark mass can be seen darting towards the staircase in the back. And I feel like it, it could be green screen, right? Now, some I mean, might say that this is simply a digital glitch and that this figure... Yo, don't ghosts have a policy that they cannot be captured on camera? You know what I mean, right? Like, maybe just a person moving too quickly for the camera to pick up clearly. However, yeah, stuff could fall and whatnot, the but... the exact same moment, a car passes by the glass door nearby. And the car can be seen in pretty crisp detail. But as for the dark mass... There are no visual details. That wasn't at all. too crisp, but I see you. It's I just see you. an odd, shapeless black mist. Even creepier, the shadow figure is very small, about the size of a young child. But what I don't do you know think? about that one, though. Is I the Huntington Museum one. haunted? You decide. Good friends Jay and that. Gino are hanging out, having a few drinks at Jay's home in England. Then this happens. The quality is so good, bro. Quality is so good. The 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 flip. Okay, I, I this one is kind of challenging because you you see the dog. He just kind of like is looking. He kind of freaked out and looked away and stuff. Jay's CCTV camera but, captures the moment when one of the glasses sitting on the table mysteriously shatters into pieces. Now, Jay has no explanation for this creepy event, but a few yeah. days later, and things just get weirder. Yeah, we might be onto someone, or something. We might be onto someone, and something. Me sideways. This time, the two friends both witness another glass explode on the table. I see right something like them. a Mentos coming Jay up. Explained in his email that he's experienced you see that? a few other strange things, but like something came and talked. Yeah. Now, the, honestly, I'm like not somebody exactly threw. sure what's causing Jay's glasses to just randomly explode. Is it paranormal? Or does the glassware manufacturer just need to do a product recall on Jay's <laughs> shitty glasses? No, I, I see you something, decide. somebody, you see something coming up, After coming school, down. So something hit it. Normal investigator Crisel Luna gets the nah, that was chance fake. to investigate a very that. old public school in Mexico that is said to be haunted. Now, most allegedly haunted locations that I talk about on this channel have long been abandoned or deserted, but this particular school is still in use. In fact, the old school building is only temporarily shut down because of the current health situation around the world. So shortly after her arrival, Criselle interviews a woman named Isabel who has worked as a cleaner and caretaker at the school for many Yo, years. These cleaners, Isabel they do have, have stories to tell. Shadows walking the school hallways and has heard strange unexplained noises throughout the building. She explains that the school was founded by a teacher named Magana, a man who lost his Magana. life inside one of the school's classrooms. Locals say that they see his ghost walking the school grounds very often at around 5 in the afternoon. And it is said that he picks up chairs and smashes them against the floor in anger. Criselle is joined by her friend Melissa as they start their investigation oh, inside the classroom where the teacher Magana is said to have passed away. When Criselle asks for a sign, things take a very bizarre turn. Yo, I, I don't want to keep watching. De verdad, con todo respeto a su energía. I'd like to, but because of all that he said, it's all there, isn't it? Yo, man, schools are just one of those places. I mean, dang. I, I think she's Spanish, right? Especially, like, Spanish areas. 
si es que él estuviera aquí, de verdad, sé que estoy jugando tal vez con fuego, pero nadie... Yo, no these no desks no are no just no like no the sets of the vibe. Ay, ahí se escucha algo. Se escu Ay, ¿qué fue? ¿Qué fue? ¿Qué fue? ¿Qué fue? ¿Qué fue? Se está escuchando algo. ¿Tú viste, Melissa? No, algo se está moviendo. Algo se está moviendo. Pero muy leve. Yeah, Ay, I'm not sure if I should, ¿Es este like, do part two of this Ay, video. Se está moviendo, ven, 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 ven. Este fue el que oh, se movió. Oh, dang. I feel like it did. It did move wholly. One of the classroom's desks suddenly begins to move on its own. Could it be that the ghost of teacher Magana is moving it? Maybe trying to pick it <laughs> I don't up know, and bro. throw it to the floor? Either way, the movement is very slight. After this scary experience, Chriselle and Melissa head over to investigate a different classroom inside the old school building that they believe is haunted by the child ghosts of former students. And this is when things start to get really creepy. Really, this classroom is way colder. Is she alone or with somebody? The soul of one or several children, I don't know. Because maybe one or several of them who attended the school died. Oh, damn, they died there. Or passed away somewhere else too. Yeah, she's with somebody. A school book moves on its own, giving both Chriselle and Melissa a bit of a fright. But they continue their investigation. The sound effects she added they find the for that library, moment. Top they also tier. find something terrifying. Oh dang. Yeah, these are a couple of little movements. I'm getting a little bit of chills, but... I also do want to know, like, does he intentionally add uh, jump scares or not? Because I really hope he doesn't, but... I'm, I have been getting that vibe that there will be a jump scare. Luckily, there hasn't been. And I'm glad that there hasn't been. So, let's keep it like that. Oh! I did see a shadow. Yeah, just go out. It's locked? Oh my god, yo, I don't wanna... Yo, dude. Yeah, I'm a little bit... I'm, I'm, it's getting up to me right now. It's getting a little... Holy crap, bro. Oh my god. They see a dark figure walking the hallway but when they oh look into the hall, God. there's no one there. The mysterious shadow figure has just disappeared into thin air. So is the old yeah. school haunted by the restless spirit of teacher Magana? And could the ghosts of former students be haunting the empty classrooms? If, if this is a fake, it's not very you well think. done fake. You if you enjoyed, keep your social credits and share this video. But click on this video on the screen and I will see you right there. Just click it, man. You're gonna 